of the mental blocks that patients have because they've been bombarded with messaging that says, once you're hurt, it takes all this time to get over an injury and you have to do all these treatments and all these things at home and rest and ice and all that kind of stuff. So this mental block is what we see a lot when patients come in. We just saw it with an eval who is a tennis player and we're gonna talk through and I'm just gonna kind of let Harriet, who's our third year DPT student, um, talk to you about what the reaction was. So tennis player comes in with a foot ankle injury, tried to play on it yesterday, couldn't do it didn't have the greatest screen when she came in today, but when we got done with her, she could do everything on the screen without symptoms. So I told her, I want you to go back and play tomorrow and see how it goes or go play right now. Just do some light drills and things like that and see how it goes. And her response was, I can't do that. It hurt yesterday. I tried that yesterday. Okay. And then what did I tell her? Well, she wasn't fixed yesterday and now she's fixed. Right. Go try it. So we just addressed all of her issues, reversed the root cause, got her to be completely symptom free with the screen. So how, if I don't send her back to play, how do I know if she's any better? Like the whole point is to get them to go back to play. But now they have this mental block where they're thinking, well, it's going to take three weeks because my friend had this injury and she went to PT and it took three weeks or four weeks or five weeks because they went to conventional physical therapy. So, um